Welcome to Technical Drawing. Today we are going to draw front view, top view, left hand side view and development of a square pyramid of base 30 mm and axis height 60 mm which is resting on its base on HP with axis perpendicular to HP and parallel to VP and all sides are equally inclined to VP. See when they say all sides are equally inclined to VP that means all sides are inclined at 45 45 but this will be only in case of a square pyramid or square object. Let's say in this, this is HPVP, this is all sides are equally inclined. So this is how it will look. This is axis, HP, VP. This is how it will look in front view. And top view you will see square. So we'll start with top view. Observer base. Observer is watching it from this side X. This is X, Y. After that, we'll take 45, 45 degree. We'll mark side 30, 30 on it. See this, these two are 45, 45, A, B, C, D, and OM. OM is axis. See this, A, B, C, D. In front view, you'll see A dash, B dash, C dash, D dash, and O dash. So height is how much? 60. So I will go 60 up. And I will draw front view. So this is A dash, B dash, C dash, D dash and C dash. This is O dash and M dash. So we are done with front view, top view. Now for side view, see I'll do dimensioning also. This is 30. This is 60. Now when OC is horizontal, see whenever OC is horizontal, O dash C dash is true length. Remember that. So that will be helpful in development. First we will draw side view. So this is D double dash, A double dash, C double dash, B double dash, O double dash. And this will be dark. See this, now we have to draw development. So what do you mean by development? When you open it, how it will look? It will look like this. 
see this with a square so for this we required true length which is in our case it is o dash c dash so you draw one vertical line then take o dash to c dash see you can rotate from here you can draw parallel but this is how i prefer i prefer drawing it one vertical line then i'll take o dash to c dash and i'll cut it outside so this is true length and then i will rotate then i'll take a to b b to c c to d and d to a you can name this a b c d e a sorry a b c d a join b to o c to o d to o join a b c d a now you can draw square any side this is lateral development after that now we'll doing total development so take b to c cut here from here also you cut then take a to c or diagonal c to a so you'll get a square remember this when they'll ask you in exam draw lateral surface development you don't have to draw a square but when they will ask you draw total surface development or you have to prepare a model that time you draw full after drawing this much what we will do we will give width see this every every corner will have a 45 degree line so that we can draw and this width would be somewhere around 5 mm if you are taking it now we have to cut it See this it will look like this then you fold each and every edges see it will be like this then you apply glue to all these edges and you can paste it like see this this will be joined like this this way it will be so this is a square pyramid this is how it will look when you see from the front see this and all sides are equally inclined it will be like this side view and for development it will look like this when you open it this is how it will look thank you